Okay, so you may well find yourself on occasions having to go and meet with your boss. Now, um, there's all sorts of different dynamics that go on when you're meeting with, uh, when you, with your boss. I'm going to borrow somebody else from the group here. Craig, can you come and give me a hand with this one, please? Can sit behind the uh, desk? The you're the boss. Yeah, of course. I mean, obviously. <laughs> he just had to look at you. <laughs> Okay, I'm, uh, I'm meeting with Craig. Craig is my boss. Now, um, Craig. <laughs> can I pick somebody else? No, okay, no, no I'm kidding. <laughs> Craig is my boss. Now, I've, I've sent him my monthly report, and Craig, calcu Craig calculated that I had used far too many paper clips this month. Um, and he's invited me to, uh, to explain myself in his office. So I've arrived and he's already sitting in his office. He's very, feeling very superior because he's in charge, so he takes up a superior gesture. Put your fingers like that. Steeple. You've done this before, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> so he steeples his fingers like this. Now, this is a very superior position to be in. Um, and, uh, and if the steeple is down like that, it means he's happy to talk. So as I come in, he's doing this and he wants to talk to me. So I take a seat here and, and I'm happy. I don't mind, he's the boss, he can be in charge here. So uh, he, he talks to me and tells me all about my uh, paperclip usage. Um, and then when the steeple comes up, raise it up, elbows on the table, that's it. <laughs> yeah, <Very> good. good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then when the steeple comes up like that, he's happy to listen now. Uh, the steeple comes up in front of his mouth, he's happy to listen to what you have to say. He'll still tap occasionally just to let you know that he really is in charge here. Um, and it, but he's happy to listen to what I have to say. So I'm talking now, but the steeple's come down. When the steeple comes down, uh, that means he wants to talk. And even if you're talking, if the steeple comes down, best you stop talking right now because the boss is going to want to say a few words. Now, of course, I've accepted this body language of his. Now, he is now feeling very confident um, that he's in total charge now. So the next position he takes up is this hands behind the head position like that. Yeah, I like that. You then, then lean back on his chair. You can't. <laughs> you, you can't. <laughs> okay, put your hands behind you. That's it. Now that position. You've done that before too. So um, now this position is a very interesting one. Hands behind the head. You can lower it down if it's not too comfortable at the moment. Um, when people do this. By the way, how many people do this? Just out of interest, how many people do this? Put your hands up, please. Hold them up. Hold them up. Uh, okay. 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 Now let me tell you what it is you're saying when you do that. You know, when, uh, it's all sorts of interesting gestures around the whole body. When people want to make themselves look important, they tend, have you noticed, they tend to stand with their hands on the hips like that. Uh, and it makes their body bigger. Have you noticed that? And then they will rock forward on their feet to make themselves taller. And when people want to be more important, they'll kind of do this sometimes. Now, it makes them taller or their body bigger. When they're putting their hands behind their head, it's making their head bigger. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so what, what's actually uh, <laughs> so <laughs> Craig put, the, put your hand behind you so when, 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 what, you, what you're actually saying with this position is uh, Craig is saying right now he's saying um, I am the most important person in this room someday you might be as important as me but I doubt it uh, pretty much what he's saying with that position keep it up keep it up now keep it up okay now, there's a couple of things you can do to manage this position. La the ladies particularly... Okay, you can lower it down. I'll, I'll, I'll come back to you. The ladies particularly dislike this in an office. So, fellas, don't do this. It's, it's a threatening gesture, and the ladies don't like it. Ladies, if a man does that, okay, and you want him to take it down, the best thing to do is to stare at his armpits. Because... <laughs> 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 Two or three seconds is all it takes and then it's gone. Okay. <laughs> but in this case, I don't want to do that. Put your hands up again. So, so what we do here, uh, if you, it, this is power play, of course, but what we do is, uh, he's done it, so I do the same thing. <laughs> now, now, we're both saying how clever we are here. And the person who wins is the person who stays up the longest. Okay. 
<laughs> so you take it down. <laughs> now, I've won that little bit of an argument power play here, but now, it, Greg doesn't feel that that's a good idea at all. Subconsciously, he found that very threatening. So he stands up to tower over me. Stand, go around that way, please. Stands up to tower over me. He comes around the table. As he comes around, I stand up and then sit on his desk. <laughs> 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 what do you do now? Yeah, you can't. <laughs> Now, I've taken ownership of his desk with my bottom, you see. <laughs> yeah. Now, he's, he's had enough now. You see the gesture, he doesn't know what to do with it now. So, he's had totally enough of this. So, he shoes me away, tells me to use as many paper clips as I like in future. Uh, and I leave, and as I'm leaving, I just turn around, invite him to join us in the bar this evening, and, but I put my hand on his door frame as I'm doing it. Okay, you can take a seat now, Craig. Give him a round of applause for that. Thank you very much. <laughs>